splendid welcome back everybody to control let's press the red very dangerous looking button and pretend nothing bad will happen i already heard him didn't i enemy mm -hmm. oh there's a stone thrower dude oh that was risky Nice. Is it coming? Oh god. <laughs> oh, you have to fight the enemy. Oh, that was that was sad. There, I just don't know. Perfect outfit. I, I I merged so well with the cable car. I just noticed. <laughs> ah, what is that? Can I open a map here. Ah. All right. Good enough. creepy oh, Follow the light. something up ahead do you see it I see light 
Nope. Nope. <sighs> nope. Plastic tree supplement. Holiday memories tree. AI 14 AE. Supplementary materials. Excerpt from altered speech of AI 14 by Dr. Theodore Ash. The results are incredible, but more so the speed of discovering this allows us. AI 14 copies our speech, but after numerous tests, we've discovered that certain words are missing from its vocabulary. We began isolating these words, cross referencing them with esoteric texts from early days of the Bureau. We found that these words, when arranged in particular formations and spoken at varying speeds and cadences, and I see the reac reaction from altered materials. We tested the specific strings of word, a formula, if you will, on the other altered items kept in the examination hall. Varying physical responses were recorded with each one with an 82% success rate. We've pro proven that words can tangibly affect these items. The specific applications must be explored, possibly for containment or identification purposes. This will drastically change our our approach, our approach moving forward, and I think there are still mo more words to be found. Samma på svenska! Hej, Bert! Vår fin! Holidays Hall! I really don't want to interrupt your holiday, your vacation. But I think I need your help. Ati? Did you miss me? Did you have this in your sock? Yes. <laughs> no, 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 no. Park, don't make a wound. You did good. Take my cassette player. You can borrow it. The song is a present from my friends to you. It will get you through the maze so you can do your job. Thank you. Really just happen? Of course it did. He gave me his cassette player. It'll get me through the maze, huh? The janitor always has the keys. Every time like like this game overall is very confusing, but every time we interact with Varsity, I am more confused than at any other point of this game. <laughs> And I said something when I started. Oh my god, when I started this episode, I, I was like an 8. Now I'm a 12. Okay, I definitely here. I needed the 8 one. For you. That sounds fun. And I still have 4 left. Say an additional enemy sounds actually fun. I only need one more. After that, okay. Looking forward. To read, totally gonna do this. Wonderful. Ah, uh, the question is now: Are we immediately going through the maze now? Because we started a new main mission. I don't know how many main mission missions we have left. Plus, I think I'm only gonna record like I will um, call it a day after this episode. Maybe actually going after Tamarcy, even though I'm a little scared because this guy was. I mean, hard to beat back in the day, like, like, he was our first boss. Uh, maybe I shouldn't be so afraid of him anymore. <laughs> Let's go after Tomasa first. Um, Turtle, where is the smallest? Is it ordinary? Or even you? And then going up there through the dump? A transit corridor. I'm sure I'm, I'm on a different level. Then again, now, I think this... Transit corridor. I think that could work. Let's give it a try. Ooh, I'm 
think we don't have so many merry missions left. I'm still a little confused. I don't think we did like their foundation, the foundation, foundation, the foundation DLC yet. I'm not sure when this is going to pop up. Ella just popped out out of nowhere after completing one specific main mission. I think that was the case. Hmm. Who knows? Who knows? For now, I want to take care of Tamarcy. It was really annoying in my early days of this game. Which is also so long ago again. <laughs> it's a bit bigger game than I thought. Especially with the DLCs, I guess. It's fine for me. I'm still having fun. Sometimes a little frustrated. But still having fun. It's over here, right? Perfect. Right where I have to be. Tamasi! Oh, no. Is he with the ball? Play? Hello. Woo! You're not Tomasi. I have no idea who's shooting at me. Okay, apparently I'm here for the first time. Maybe this is actually... There you are. Ah! I'm, I'm already so hurt.
blank fucker is still alive, I think. Exactly. Worse, already a lot of uh, very hurt when I came here. Could it be? It's not the best starting position for that. Okay, let me try this again, but less hurt. <laughs> good, good, good strategy. Less hurt. <sighs> Maybe just ignoring these fuckers. Like, I know where I have to go now. I thought he was actually maybe somewhere in this bigger area, but maybe just ignoring them. I don't know, this is an option. Ah. Okay, let me see what my options are here. The, the, the invisible fuckers, they, you take so much damage. Cover. Okay. There you are. want you. different position. It is so easy until the flying fuckers are popping up and then everything at once is a little too much to handle right now. God damn it cowards without these guys would you kill you the first try try for first try down okay <laughs> maybe going up there is an up maybe this works better I'm not sure guys oh man okay okay let's go Maybe working with my shield. Is my shield protecting me from the invisible fucker scream? There are 
more explosives. Any energy here. Antlesparker is still alive. Oh my god! Aha! I can't focus on too many things at once. This is very hard right now. Jesus! <laughs> Remember, I said I want to work with my shield. I can't believe that to mercy. I'm really thorn. I, I learned. I oh got he's harder now than he was back then. Uh, <laughs> harder to defeat, which makes sense because we're much further in the game. It's totally, totally, totally makes sense. He's not the problem. Then again, he hits really hard. This is a problem. Beating him is not a problem. Getting hit by him and the invisible fucker, this is a problem. Oh man. Okay, here we go again. Girl! Okay. <laughs> Not what I wanted you to do. Ah, come out. Come out! There you are. Flying fucker.
Walker, head of communications. We should start looking for a new head of communications. Ugh. Curse your old one is dead. Dad in the crowd. That worked well. Very proud of us, Jesse. We did well. Okay, let me see what we have here. Sterling Samary. 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 AWE 46. Sterling. Event Samary. A paranatural object appeared in a field outside the town of Sterling, Colorado. Near a billboard advertising. Beep! No civilians were injured. Their family dog has been reported as missing since the event. It went response. Local authorities arrived on the scene and began issuing orders over a monitored line of communication using several watchwords flagged by the bureau, including beep. Bureau agents from the regional office were dispatched and arrived two hours after local police. The situation was contained and a lot analysis began. Bureau research staff arrived the next day and examined the object. After beep days of evaluation, the object was lifted into an enclosed truck with built in black rock panels and relocated to Bureau headquarters via the separate transit system leading into the oldest house. Okay, let me see. We had some loot here. Mm. Really? Now? Okay, let me check very quick. How can I have 26 of <laughs> 24? <laughs> oh God, what the fuck is this bullshit? Are you kidding me? Yeah, three also. No. Fuck off. Here? No. No thing. Uh, can I get in here? Oh yeah, maybe. <sighs> okay, no, no, let's let's take the stairs. Ooh. Okay, let's go with you first. Sterling supplement. Our Sterling AWE forty six details. Local witnesses report a bright flash in the field at approximately beep, no noise, accompanied the light. Authorities had assumed the object fell from the sky, but our examination found the object actually manifested there, vaporizing the soil around it in an intense spherical beep, beep, which possibly explains the light seen from the tail. The object is a hollow sphere made of a stone-like material. Structural analysis of the material does not beep on record. The sphere has a broken portion as of something beep from the object. The object has been inactive since arriving at the burrow. The communications department officially started to price that, uh, that the object was a small meter, media, meteor while also using the America Overnight program to beep see episode 92. Note, this AWRE will be studied in the containment sector until a spherical object is deemed safe to be transferred to the investigation sector. Apparently, not safe enough. Then again, investigation sector, I mean, yeah, okay. Uh, did you pick it up? Where, how? Ah, oh, because it's a weapons mod. Ah! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Yeah, because, no, no, what, what have you done? Oh, Jesus. The curse has spam in my inventory. Like, I started at the beginning of this record session. I, I cleared out my inventory of all the lame stuff. And with lame stuff, I mean everything below four, below three, four, three including. <laughs> just go, just go. Okay, I will check this later. Let me listen to this first. You're listening to America Overnight, now in our 29th year, lifting the veil between fiction and reality. Thank you for staying up with us. I've been getting a lot of calls about this meteor in Sterling, Colorado. There were reports of a large spherical container that crash landed in a field outside town. Some government people reportedly took it away. Now, we happen to broadcast from Colorado, and Sterling isn't far. I drove down myself to check it out with members of the America Overnight team. I don't need to tell you, it wasn't long before we found pieces of metal debris scattered in a field. Listeners, 
this is yet another instance of an unidentified flying object, or UFO, entering our airspace and crashing. That the government took away the evidence under cover of darkness only compounds the fact that these are more than likely visitors from beyond our planet, or dare I say, solar system. Head on over to our website to see pictures of the spacecraft pieces we uncovered. And while you're doing that, our sponsors would like your ear. America Overnight, we'll be right back. Wild. The whole America Overnight thing. <sighs> okay. Yeah, we're already at ahead of 30 minutes. I would like to speak to Emily so we can actually really, really complete this quest. Just making sure I think I'm done here, yeah. Let's hope I can make it back to the fast traveling point before getting attacked again. <laughs> so far, what you guys? I was wondering where I didn't get any ability points for that, but probably after I talk to Emily. Where do we have again? There we are. Central Executor. I think it was the first. Ah, I was about to say it was the first time in a while that I struggled with a boss during a main quest, but it wasn't a main quest. Mal is actually was not part of the main quest. The main story is so much easier than all the side stuff that is going on here. <laughs> but there was still one of the fairly easier bosses, at least for me. Uh, I only needed one, like try, uh, three tries. I <laughs> try tries. <laughs> Prisoners mix in German and English in a very elegant way since twenty twenty. I don't know when I started streaming and content creating in English. It's a few years ago. Three. I only need about three or maybe four tries. Unlike other refrigerator related bosses we have here, we do not talk about. I don't want to talk about that. I want to talk with Emily. Yeah, I have good news and bad news. You need still a new head for communications. I took care of the Tomasi problem. Sorry, I forget he was a coworker. Don't apologize. That wasn't the real Tomasi. He died when the hiss got him. You're right. I just didn't want to be insensitive. Oh. Sentimentality is a weakness in situations like these, Jesse. Oh. It's Bureau 101. Oh. I don't think Emily's in danger of being called sentimental. <laughs> of course, she sticks to the rules. Okay. Now there are my ability points. I should Perfect. get going. Don't let me hold you up. Anything new here? Sometimes we had some documents. No, this doesn't seem to be the case. Okay, uh, let me see what I can do with these ability points. Inventory management, I will probably do at the beginning of the next record session again. But at least my ability points. Oh yeah, I have found a new outfit somewhere. Okay, I will check this out as well. I think it's a janitor outfit. Yeah, yeah, I remember here. This is what I want, all right? Size an additional enemy. Sounds good to me. I have two left. Hmm? Levitation or duration? Like it's both durations. <laughs> it's duration. Mm. I think I'm very good with the levitation right now. Here, this looks sounds fine to me. Okay, oh, it's too little. Ignore it. <laughs> Ignore the abilities here, but I really the shield. What can you do when really shield approaches debris at nearby enemies? For the holding shield, use a way to rush at enemies and knock them back. Okay, that sounds a little fun. I'm not sure yet. Says late enemies when their health is low. That also sounds like a good thing. Okay, let me see this outfit real quick. <laughs> it's kind of cute, but I just started wearing the golden suit. It's just, and it's, it is so. I like the golden suit. <laughs> At least for a little long, or we stick to it. What will we do at the beginning of the next time? Okay, we only have three things left. Uh, two things. Sorry, I forgot. We do not do the jukebox here. I really do not know how much maester we have left, so maybe we go for the runaways first. Where are they all scattered? Containment, containment, executive. Oh, one of them is actually somewhere here. And the dead letters. Okay. I mean, right now, it sounds like something to do. Moving letters. Traffic light, Japanese paper lantern. These are Langston's runaways, and we will find them. 
in the next episode. For now, I really hope you enjoyed that one and you will be back for the next one. I will f find you. <laughs> I fucked it up. I will find you. You will find me. I will see you. Uh, whatever. Bye.